guys welcome to another video so today's video we will be reviewing the sephora best skin ever foundation i just picked this up it just came today so i ordered it sometime the beginning of the week or whatever it's a 20 dollar foundation so if you want to see how it applies and what i think and all that good stuff make sure you keep on watching don't forget to like comment and subscribe Bye guys. Best skin ever. And it comes in 50 shades and I got the shade 50 in. This is what the website matched me to. So I'm not sure. I didn't go inside the store. So let's hope that this works. Okay. What is it? Medium buildable coverage for the look of naturally perfected skin so it's just a medium foundation and it was i don't even know so it was twenty dollars and the shade i have says medium to dark with neutral undertones i have more of golden undertones i'm not sure exactly how that's going to work um natural finish foundation with long wearing wear that hydrates skin for up to 12 hours and it's infused with skincare benefits so let's see i haven't primed my face but i think i'm going to use my elf puff puff primer only because i'm almost out and i need to use it versus letting it just dry out so i'm gonna use a pump of that also i'm almost out of this the milani prime correct medium to dark skin tones primer so i'm going to use some of that just for my discoloration and as you can see it's orange and so that would be just around my mouth area where i have those spots that from wearing that mask so only because this does not say that it's like totally matte, 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 matte. I'm gonna put a little powder. So I'm gonna use my Sephora Peach Perfect Translucent. I'm just gonna dab a little bit to make sure I'm somewhat matte because it doesn't stay, it just says natural finish. So this is what I would do with any other foundation anyway. So just treat it like any other foundation let's see so hopefully it's in a glass bottle and it's 25 no it's 0.84 fluid ounces so it comes the pump yay I, I don't know why i thought i was gonna have to just pour it on my hand so let's see Ooh. let's see guys you need to stop matching people online. Oh, it kind of go. We'll see. So I'm going to take two pumps because a lot comes out in those pumps. So it looks like this on my thing. As you can see, I put all foundation on there. I'm just going to take a brush to apply. Let's do one side first. Ooh. It's kind of thick. Yeah, it is thick. It's not runny at all. I'm going to take my Shopman's A brush. Sephora has been known to have some good things like their Micro Smooth Powder. That was good. I love that. What else I have? Their Lip um lip liner is good so i said why not try this so can you see the difference between the two sides it definitely gave me some coverage but it says once again it says that it is medium so not full medium buildable coverage oh 
Oh, this coverage is pretty. Does it match me a little bit? Mm. And it's nighttime, so I can't even look in the daytime in the daylight to see how I'm looking. So as you can see, that was two pumps, right? I'm just gonna take my wet real estate neat, neat sponge to pat it out. Just to make sure I don't have any streaks or anything. I look gray. Do I look gray? I feel like nothing is on my skin. I don't feel like I have on anything, to be honest. Which is a good thing. So, that's two pumps. That's all I'm going to do is two. Well, let me try a little bit. I have. Let's see. I'm going to try a little bit on the dark areas to see if maybe I can build it up. And my mustache. Yummy. We're going to speed through with the concealer and all that good jazz, and we'll be right back. Okay guys, let's spray with the Morphe setting spray.
let's gently pat it in. Okay guys, this is the final look, trying the new Sephora Best Skin Ever Foundation. And I must say, I am impressed. Like I said, Sephora has some really, really good products from their brand. So, it gave me a medium coverage. I guess because I put the powder on, I'm semi-matte. Not really, it's not tight. So, that's a good thing. And I don't see any of my pores because, you know, you have to be careful with some um, foundations because they seem to insinuate your pores. So my pores are good. That's why I use the e.l.f. Um, Puff Puff Primer because it's supposed to, like, blur your pores or whatever. So my pores are good. So this is good. And for $20, that's how much drugstore um, foundations are costing now. So, yeah. Um, do I think it's my perfect match? I do not. But I think this is as close as it's going to get. Like, it won't get any better than this. Maybe they'll expand the shades. And let me see how many dark shades they have. They only have eight dark deep dark shades so maybe they'll expand over time but yeah i like this this can be a cool everyday um foundation so if you enjoyed this quick video please make sure you like comment and subscribe and of course i'll see you in my next video bye guys